How's it going, folks? My name is XGR, and welcome to what I'm going to start calling Weapon Wednesday. Today, we're actually going to do a cord wrapping on a baseball bat. So, I did a, a questionnaire thing on Twitter, and the colors that I gave you were blue, pink, and then white. As you can see, this is the wrap that we're going to do on uh, this axe. It's a pretty good wrap. It gives you a lot of extra control. Um, and of course, the color that won was blue. So we're gonna wrap up this baseball bat in blue. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. The thing that I wanna do first is um, I wanna actually figure out what length, um, to what length I actually need this that so we're gonna go ahead and do that and what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a what I like to call an introductory wrap so we're just gonna start by wrapping the bat now remember this is not the actual wrap this wrap would be just to kind of get an idea of the length that we'll need. I have a little pair of scissors um, for, they're actually for cutting yarn and line for when you sew, but it works pretty darn well for cutting paracord. Now the other thing that we need is a quick, sorry about that, oh there we go, that's better. Now for this, what we're actually going to do is we're going to pull it back a little bit Cut that off. See, we got pieces flying everywhere. We're gonna take our lighter if I can figure out how to use it. Burn the tip just a little bit, and then we're going to just seal it up a little bit. All right. Now Okay, so this is 24 feet of paracord that we're gonna be using to actually build, do this little project. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. There's a couple of different ways that you can do this. I'm gonna go ahead and just do my favorite method. If I can find the edge, okay, perfect. The, the end is not really as important because you're gonna start actually building over this. 
So don't worry so much about how it looks because we're gonna actually tie it in to the rest of the boat. So now you take two fingers. The part that's attached to the bat is gonna go at the top here. Then you're gonna lay it underneath the bat. And the part that goes underneath is gonna go through part that lays underneath is going to go through and you have to pull all 24 feet through the hole that you just made. Of course I get stuck on this. Alright. So get used to seeing a lot of cords flying everywhere. Okay so we have our first shape. It doesn't look like much, but it's gonna evolve. Okay, so then you take the same way, and you're just gonna keep going over to the other side. Make sure this piece that you put in that's a little bit extra is strapped in, is gonna continue to run down the side. And you just keep working your way. Tiny short little tail is all that's left. Might be able to get the last pass out of that one. Don't think I'll be able to get one more. Nope, this is just too short. Okay, so now that we have concluded this part, there's a couple of ways. It's a lot of grip. Uh, a couple of ways to just finish this off. I have this tucked under this part right here. If I want to do that. Again, actually, I'm gonna just go ahead and do that one more time. So I can do a double wrap, and I'm going to zoom in on this once it's done, so I can show you what it looks like. Okay, so see, there's the, the double on that end piece. Being nice and tight. Well, what I'm gonna do is just going to part of my arm, snip it off right there, take a little blowtorch to it. It doesn't have to look terribly pretty. I'll just use the cap end. Kind of melt it down. And give it some what of a structure. There we go. Alright, so all in all. This is how it came out. Pretty actually, pretty happy with it. I think it came out good. Came out pretty well. Uh, I'll be testing it sometime in the future. This is what the entire bat looks like. See, there's the white, well, cold steel part. So I wanted to kind of break it up a little bit. I might do a project where I put a little white um, end cap over this on both sides. But I don't know if that's necessary right now. I think this is a pretty good tight little wrap. As you can see, both my hands go over pretty well. So I think that's it. Uh, we did that in 23 minutes. So the entire length of this video is 23 minutes. It's going to be cut down. So anyway, uh, that's it for Weapon Wednesday. I will catch you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.